Wait, there's another. There's another place. I must explore. Oh. Bait shop. And ship repair. Andy. You know, the voodoo lady's locket looks awfully worn around the edges. I wonder if it has another use. I hope it has another use. Hi there. I understand you do ship repair here? You! I thought I told you to stay away from this place! Especially after that stunt you played at the Royal Aquarium! But I... Ha! <laughs> I'm just messy with you, handsome! It's me, Anemone! Oh. Uh, you got me. Uh, how'd you get up here? I swam! So, what did you say you needed? I swam! Uh... Yeah, so you sell bait and repair ships. So you sell bait and repair ships here. That's an odd pairing. Well, times are tough. Sometimes you gotta pick up an extra job or two just to earn enough sand dollars to live on. That's tough. Yeah. You think that's bad? And this place used to be a bait shop and pizza joint. And I still couldn't sell any anchovies. That's pretty bad. Also, I actually have a shade of lipstick that exactly matches that shade of this one's lips, of that person's lips. I kind of wish I was wearing it right now, but you know what? Missed opportunities. Uh, let's see. I need my mask repair. Sure thing. You want a patch job or a full mask repair? Uh, it's just a crack. I guess a patch job will do. See, that's how they get you. A patch job is basically the same amount of work as a full replacement, but it's certain to go bad on you a lot faster. I give you a full mask replacement. I'll be right back. Oh, okay. Hmm. Why do I have that song stuck in my head? There we go, all fixed. Your man, Mr. Winslow, took care of the bill. Nice guy, that Reggie. Does he have a cousin? I don't know. Uh... Yeah, how'd you do that? How'd you repair my ship so fast? I'm telling you, mouse replacement is easy. There are a whole slew of trees out there on Spoon Isle Beach just perfect for mouse. Not to mention the fact that they are just sitting by the water's edge where I can easily grab one. I just float one over to your ship, a flip, a flop, and it's done. Hey, cool. I think I'm good. See ya. Don't be a stranger. Alrighty. So, I mean, now I got that done. You shall never have them. Let's forget about the artifacts for a moment. The artifacts are sacred. I will not let them. Hi, El Lemonade. Hello, Sailor. Uh, let's see. Cool raft. Can I ride it? Do you have a pass? Actually, I do. Here you go. One official Vakalian transit pass. Good for 24 hours. I bet you are. Huh? The raft is yours for the day. Just hop on board and use it to sail anywhere within the Jerkbait Islands. Thanks. That's... pretty cool. I like that. Hmm. Spoon Isle? And Little Row Island. Uh, let's go to Spoon Isle. Look, would you just give me the artifact so we can bury it and get out of here? Nope. But McGillicutty gave it to me. <coughs> I get to be the one who picks where to hide it. Sorry, I got it now. Will you at least look at me so we can work this out? <laughs> nope. I bet that's the seahorse artifact the Merleader was talking about. I wonder if they'll just let me have it. Probably oh, not. Let me have it. Nope. <coughs> hey guys, what's going on? None of your business. Now why don't you back away? You're stinking up the place. <laughs> oh yeah? Well, you don't smell so... Okay, this is awkward, but you guys smell amazing. Yes, it's the savory smell of thinly sliced potatoes. Fried, crisp, and golden with a touch of honey and a dash of salt. Hmm. 
How I long to be back in the kitchen peeling my potatoes. That sounds really good. Yeah, I long for that too. What are you guys arguing about? Oh, Captain McGillicutty ordered us to hide the summoning artifact we found far away from the Jerkbait Islands <coughs> until he was able to secure the rest of them. Only he won't give me the artifact back. <coughs> hey, shut your trap. I'm working here. Look, I'm sorry, Merkel, but McGillicuddy clearly gave the idol to me. It's my duty, so I want to make sure this gets done right. I want to be the one who decides where to bury it. Sorry, Killick, but if it meant that much to you, you shouldn't have left it sitting out in the open while you took a nap. And by out in the open, you mean placed in a small box, wrapped in wool and stuffed down my pants? Well, if you didn't want pirates rummaging through your trousers while you were sleeping, you should have said so. I've got it now. I'll decide where to bury it. Sure, whatever you say, dude. Um. Can I have that seahorse? You mean this seahorse that Captain McGillicutty gave us to hide until all the artifacts are found? Of course. In fact, why don't we just give you the treasure and then rip off our own arms so our captain don't have to? Beat it! Well, try that. Uh, let's see. You know, it's getting awfully late in the day. What time did McGillicuddy want this done by? Oh boy, he's right. I don't care who buries it. Let's just go. Come on, keep up. Hey, my raft. What? You assholes. Well, that didn't go very well. That was fast. Good and buried. Now we wait for McGillicuddy to pick us up. It's a pile of fallen trees. Hey, you guys, I'm back. Oh, goody. What are you guys still doing here? Just biding our time till McGillicuddy sails round to pick us up. <coughs> you know, I hear that nine times out of ten, the first place you bury your treasure is the spot where it'll most likely be found. What do you mean? Well, if you picked out that spot so easily, other pirates will probably pick that spot to go digging for treasure, too. He's right. We need to bring the treasure back and think of somewhere else to hide it. Good thinking, Hookie. Come on, let me have it. Too late. I still got the artifact. All right, uh, I don't know what to do there. All right. Oh, and just to tell you guys, I do have a spoiler free guide up. Why? Because I... First off, just watching me just walk around and not know what to do, not very entertaining. Second off, um, I really don't want to have to edit all that shit out, you know? And it is completely spoiler free. The only thing that it has, it's like literally like a list format. Like, let's see if I can get it. You probably can't see it, but it's like a list format of what to do. Like, it's like, go here. How about this? It doesn't like give any of the actual story away which is fine but let's see hey you guys i'm back oh goody and i'm not just like going through and reading the entire section i'm just getting hints and going off of those and then once i get stuck then i'm like all right i need to look again uh let's see Fair maybe way to there's a fair it. way to determine who gets to bury the artifact. Yeah, maybe. Oh yeah? Well, what do you suggest? Let's see. Guessing a number. You try guessing a number. Whoever answers right gets to bury it. That sounds reasonable. I'll start. Pick what number I'm thinking of. Mmm, 27. Nope. Okay, now you pick a number. 42. Wrong. Wait a minute. How do I know you ain't lying? Me? What about you? Okay, this ain't gonna work. Forget it. Damn. Um. Maybe you guys should try cooperating again. Fine. Got any more bright ideas? Bro, 
breath holding contest. How about a breath holding contest? First one to breathe for air loses. I like where you're going with that, but no. With me asthma, it wouldn't be a fair contest. Well, then I win by default. No, because I still got the seahorse. That makes you a loser by default. Yeah, no, I can understand. Maybe you guys should try the cooperating again. Uh, Fine. Got any more bright ideas? Which, that's all to say, I don't have asthma. I have friends who have asthma. Um, but I didn't... Per I don't personally have it. I think I did when I was, like, really, really young. But... That was a while ago. Like, I'm talking, like, Babby Scarlet. Like, literal Babby Scarlet. I think had some kind of thing. Because I remember finding an inhaler with my name on. I'm like, hey, Mom, what's this? And she's like, oh, that's just, like, an inhaler from when you were a baby. Because apparently I had problems with my lungs. Uh, preemie babies normally have some respiratory issues. Anyway. Long tangent. Getting on. Let's see. Uh, going on. Without that tangent following, let's see, staring contest. How about a staring contest? First one to blink loses. Hey, I like that idea. Yeah, it's so simple. Boom! Ah, what'd you do that for? I was winning. No, you weren't. You were just about to blink. Sorry, guys, I couldn't resist. Bah, this is pointless. Hey, guys, I'm back. Oh, goody. Maybe you guys... Fine. I think that staring contest was working. You should try again. Yeah, good idea. <laughs> Dark Ninja Dave. Look behind you! It's a Dark Ninja Dave action figure! Really? I've never actually seen one in person. Nice chest. But it looks a little empty. There's Damn it! Nothing there! Sorry, it was probably just a weather balloon. Hey, you guys, I'm back. I pressed the wrong thing. Oh, goody. Mm. Fine. Uh, yeah. Look, a distraction. Look, a distraction. Oh, what's it distracting? Yeah. All right, so. Pirate. Pi the pirate. Parrot. Fuck. Bon voyage. Did you say something? Nope. Not me. Maybe it was Captain McGillicuddy. Neptune's beard! If he sees we haven't buried this chest yet, he might just bury us instead! Come on, come on, we've got to go now! Yeah, that might be a good idea. Yeah, but the thing is All with right. the uh, parrot... Hey, me, Street Boy. Why do you it? Now we'll be able to find it. So... It works. Well, that's that. Done <laughs> and buried. <laughs> All right. Stationary cannon. Huh. Fun. I like how that's his reaction. This is like, oh, fun. All right. Now we just get to wander in a Lost Woods-esque kind of thing. Except you don't get returned to the uh, front all the time. That was a skeleton. Okay. That's fine. Alright. I reached the end of the line. That's fine. See. More of Akalian ruins. This looks like some kind of old furnace. Or maybe a barbecue? You know, it's kind of different. That won't do anything. It's not even on. Okay, well... Just wait for a bunch of me trying to jam that locket into like all the things because it's like it said that it probably had a different purpose because it was worn around the edges, you know? Like, whenever you say that, I'm like, oh, now I get to slam this into everything and hope that it's gonna do something, right? Right. All right, that's that's a nothing path. Oh god, okay, okay, all right, okay. 
A fishing, fishing well. well. Fishing well? They probably meant wishing well. I'm sure it's just a typo. You sure? You sure about that? Free bait. Good for one order of fish eggs. Coupon valid at most participating Jerkbait Island locations. Cool. Neat. Coupon! A fishing well. Fishing well. Fishing well? Okay, well, there's nothing there. Ah, damn it. 